Hello viewers, Windows 10 has just received its final optional bug fix C release update. It's a strange to think this is the last official C release update for Windows 10 according to the Microsoft. Looking at the calendar, this is the final optional update in October on the 14th. Windows 10 will get its last security and cumulative update unless you are signed up for the ESU extended security update program. The update rolled out late yesterday in my region on this Windows update page. You will see its optional that means you don't need to install it unless you have turned on the toggle that make optional update install automatically. If you don't install it now, it will roll into next month page Tuesday update, which will be the last page Tuesday security update for Windows 10. The update is KB5066198. It's a very small update which makes sense. Since support is almost over, there are no more feature or changes, just two pixels. Microsoft fixed an issue where some users couldn't connect to share folder and file if they were using the SMBV1 protocol on NetBIOS or TCP IP. This problem start after installing update KB5065429, which was this month's page security update. This manually affects businesses and enterprises. The second fix addresses a problem with Windows Autopilot when deploying Windows 10 version 22H2 devices with the enrollment status page ESP enable might not see it load properly during the out of box experience. Again, this mostly affect corporation not home user. So this update only include minor improvements and fixes. Since it's optional, I usually recommend not installing optional update unless you are directly affected by the issue. If you skip it, these fixes will be included in next month page Tuesday update anyway. After installing, if you check the about Windows menu by typing Venwa in search, the build number of Windows 10 will be 19045.6396. That's at the last optional bug fix release for Windows 10 according to the Microsoft. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.